Hey, good morning, everybody. How are we enjoying that snow day? Cleveland City Schools are out today. We don't see this very often during the course of winter, so I really hope that you guys enjoy the snow day. Now, I know not everybody's out, so that kind of stinks for those of you who had to get out and about on the roads this morning. It was messy out there. I'm hoping everybody made it in just fine. I know it was a slow go for you out there, but that's all right. This will be our worst commute of the week. Tomorrow's commute, Thursday's commute, and Friday not looking too bad from a weather perspective. I do think there will be some snow around, but out of all the commutes for the rest of the week, this one was the worst. Uh, it only gets better from here on out. It's about 9.16, and I wanted to pop in and give you guys a quick weather update. You know, we can post snapshots all day long of the radar, and here's what's happening. But I think it kind of helps to do it in video form. So looking out uh, over downtown Cleveland, this is the camera shot from our station in downtown. We're looking towards CSU. So there's Chester. Uh, it looks like at least the road is clear in this area, which is excellent news. But once you start to get a little closer to the east side, um, and visibility is down. So please take it slowly out there. I'm actually going to pop over to this other computer and check the visibility for you. And it looks like in Cleveland right now, uh, visibility has definitely improved in terms of we're no longer down to less than a quarter mile. I saw that in some spots early this morning, but we do have some fog developing. We have a southwest wind. Uh, it's cold outside and of course the snow falling. So not the most beautiful morning out there. Here's the radar cloudy skies on that satellite imagery and pretty much everyone is still seeing at least light snow. It's not as heavy as it was earlier this morning and it's actually not quite as widespread. I've also had some reports this morning that there may be a little grapple mixing in, maybe a little freezing rain. So watch for slick spots. I do not, as of this hour, have any reports from our observation sites of freezing rain, but I've had a few people reach out to me on social media and say that, hey, they did see some freezing rain. So again, just watch out for it. Most of the observation sites are reporting light snow. Lorraine right now, Illyria, uh, is actually reporting mixed precipitation. So again, there might be a little sleet or grapple mixing in here, but most of this is just uh, run of the mill snow, not making for the best morning. Here are my thoughts through time. Got future view pulled up for you. So you've seen the radar, which is current, and then future view takes us through time. Notice how even through the afternoon, we've still got some precipitation out there, whether it's snow, maybe a little rain mixing in, a little sleet, just kind of a gross day for us. Evening commute could feature some scattered snow showers, even through 7, 8 o'clock tonight. So any dinner plans you have, you need to watch out for the potential for some snow showers. Closer to midnight, though, this really starts to taper off. And most of the overnight, not too bad. Many of us will get through it dry. I do think we could see a little lake effect developing through the day tomorrow morning uh, and into the afternoon. So we will need to keep a close watch on that. Then the rest of the week, uh, Thursday, Friday, just flurries possible. Nothing major. It is going to get a lot colder, though. Got my forecast sheet here, and uh, let's see, can you see Thursday, Friday, highs in the 20s. I know that maybe it looks backwards to you, but either way, 20s, Thursday, Friday, overnight lows in the teens, and then Super Bowl Sunday, guys, we could see some snow. I think our next actually best chance we're seeing not so much lake effect, but a bigger, more widespread system moving through to bring us some snow. That's going to be on Sunday. Super Bowl Sunday, we need to watch it. I'm gonna be looking at the new model data coming into the Weather Center throughout the morning. And of course, I'll have a full update on the weather situation coming up on Cleveland 19 News at noon. I hope you guys have a great day. If it's a snow day for you, I hope you enjoy it.